Hello everybody, welcome to Get Weld Soon, because you know I'm gonna get you weld soon, right? We're gonna do we're gonna do some 6010 today, overhead. I'm gonna try to do a couple different angles with the camera while I'm welding so you can see exactly what you're doing. Also, uh, it's it's not like 7010. You can 7010, you can literally push that rod. You can feel it pushing against the metal and just hold it there and let it burn on the, with a 70, 7018. You do not want to do that with 6010 or 7010 uh, because it will dig a hole in your plate. Uh, so don't do that. Uh, you, you actually have to hold the arc. You can't just push it up there like you can 7018. A little bit longer of an arc than, than you will with 7018. And uh, you'll see what I'm saying. Let's burn. Wait a minute, did you subscribe yet? So you almost, almost kind of long arc it compared to 7018. Uh, where you just hold it really tight with 7018, but anyway, uh, you pull out ahead of your puddle uh, Just basically enough enough time for your puddle to freeze and then you go back and start another one right in front of that one And you just do it over and over and over and that's how you do it uh, with these um, It's how you what they call st stacking dimes, but uh, I'm not great at it. I'll admit <laughs> It's been a long time since I ran these rods, so I'm pretty rusty uh, actually right here you can tell um, I skip ahead too much a couple of times and uh, But anyway, it, it turns out pretty decent in the end, but uh Anyhow, you can you can see where I skip ahead too much and then where I stack them tight but uh, So I'm also showing you what not to do <laughs> but, uh, And just so you know if you've never welded this uh, 6010 or 7010 overhead uh, you definitely want to have some good sleeves on uh, try to stay out from under the fire but uh it's hard because it uh it definitely throws some fire and it will burn you up also this is 1 8 rods at 90 amps So here's the end result, guys. Uh, like I said, it's, it's not beautiful, but pretty decent. And uh, there's actually a little hole right there uh, where I skipped ahead too much and it left a little crater. Now, I don't run this rod very often. I haven't in a long time, actually, uh, so I'm pretty rusty. But hopefully this video gives you enough information where you can uh, pick it up and uh, understand it and practice enough and get good at it. So remember, guys, a little longer arc than 7018. If you're used to welding 7018, uh, give it a little longer arc. And I uh, just start a puddle, come out of the puddle. Start a puddle, come out of the puddle. And uh, try those two things. Just remember, stack your puddles. Stack your puddles tight, uh, like dimes, as they say. Look like stack. Make it look like stack dimes. Anyway, I hope this video really helped. Uh, if you have any questions, of course, just shoot them down in the comments. Whatever you do, definitely don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you on the next one.